I've never been to New York, but I want to go to New York now just based off being at Kornblatt's. After 32 years, Portland's oldest Jewish deli will be closing by the end of the month. The owner's saying it's because of rising food and labor costs. It's a little hard to hear, but it's like, okay, how many times in the next 10 days or so can I get down here? The line was out the door. Customers waiting for their very first Kornblatt's meal like Jacob Thompson or their 100th meal like Donna Page. It's so good. Who has been one of their number one supporters since they opened back in 1991. I'm sitting here and just before this started, I was crying. It's, it's hard to see go. It really is. Donna Page is Jewish and says she found a sense of community at Kornblatt's, along with pastrami, bagels, and matzo ball soup. And like many other longtime customers, Page is heartbroken to hear about the closure. I, I watched um, Roses go. I've watched other delis go. And um, it's just like losing another piece of you. And <clears throat> it's where I... I've drugged my kids and my grandkids to come and connect them in another way with who we are. The owner says he made this decision after seeing business change during the pandemic and it made it more difficult to stay open. And while goodbyes are difficult, Paige has one last message to the owners. Thanks for the memories. And I miss Kramer up on the wall. They took him down. <laughs> now, March 31st will be the last day Kornblatt's will be open. Henry Higgins Boiled Bagels has bought the space and will be opening as early as May 1st. Brittany? Yeah, just a Portland institution. It's going to be hard to say goodbye. Thanks so much, Daisy.